By the time you're done using this app, you may not even notice your hearing loss anymore. Hey guys, Cliff Olson, doctor of audiology and founder of Applied Hearing Solutions in Phoenix, Arizona. And in this video, I'm reviewing the new working memory module inside of the Lace AI Pro auditory training app. If you ask me, other than using hearing aids, using Lace AI Pro is probably the easiest and best way to significantly improve your hearing. And if you happen to combine using Lace AI Pro with your hearing aids, then you're gonna be hearing better than what you could with just your hearing aids alone. Lace, which stands for Listening and Communication Enhancement, has been around for over 20 years, and it's a form of auditory training. Think of it like physical therapy for your ears. Not only has LACE been around for over 20 years, but it is backed by a ton of research. In fact, there's been over 80 research studies done on LACE to prove its efficacy. Originally, LACE auditory training was completed by ordering a set of DVDs that had all four of the different training modules, including speech and noise training, working memory training, rapid speech training, as well as visual speech reading. While performing these individual training modules was effective for significantly improving your ability to hear, it wasn't really that convenient and it didn't use content that you were interested in. Fortunately, this original version of LACE was converted into an app called LACE AI Pro. Now, each of these four different LACE training modules is getting rolled out in phases, starting with the speech and noise training. Now, I just got done reviewing the speech and noise training module that I will have linked in the description of this video if you want to check it out for yourself to see exactly how this app is able to significantly improve your hearing and background noise. But like I promised in that original review video, if you have a lifetime license of Lace AI Pro, then any new module that ever gets released inside of this app, you'll have access to as well, and that includes this new working memory module. Now, if you ultimately decide that you would like to get a lifetime license of Lace AI Pro, I will have it linked in the description of this video with a pretty significant discount code for Dr. Cliff channel subscribers. But before I get into my review of the working memory module inside of Lace AI Pro, do me a huge favor and click the like button. It really helps out the channel. And if you are not yet subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on, go ahead and do that as well. It is greatly appreciated. And let me know down in the comment section if you are already using Lace AI Pro and what you think about it. Now we have nearly two decades of research that has linked hearing loss with increased rates of cognition decline. And included in cognition is your working memory. Working memory is extremely important when it comes to your hearing. Essentially, working memory is your brain's ability to temporarily hold and manipulate information for cognitive tasks like problem solving, reasoning, and comprehension. It acts as a mental workspace, allowing us to process and use incoming information in real time. When it comes to hearing optimally, working memory is critical for several reasons. First is understanding speech and background noise. When you enter a challenging listening environment like a restaurant, working memory helps you fill in the missing gap gaps of speech information that you missed because noise interfered with it. If you have good working memory, your brain can piece together missing auditory information, so even if you miss some speech information, your brain is able to make sense of what you heard. If you have bad working memory, on the other hand, your brain is not capable of filling in missing gaps of speech information, which means that all the information that you can hear doesn't really make sense to you. Meaning that with or without hearing treatment, if you have bad working memory, you are going to struggle in a background noise situation. The second reason working memory is so important is for processing complex information. When someone is speaking in really long sentences and they're giving you a lot of information and potentially complex information, you need working memory to be able to remember what they said at the beginning of their sentence so the second half of their sentence actually makes sense. People who struggle with working memory typically feel like people are speaking too fast for them because they're trying to process what they're saying as they're saying it, even if the person speaking is not speaking at an overly fast rate. So if you think that I'm speaking too fast inside of this video, then chances are you're having a decline in your working memory. The third reason working memory is so important is for following along with multiple conversations. When you have multiple people speaking at the same time, it requires good working memory to identify who is speaking and to keep up with the flow of conversation. If you happen to struggle in small group situations, even if there's no background noise, there's a high probability that you're having difficulty with your working memory. The fourth reason working memory is so important is being able to hear with a hearing loss. Now, if you have a hearing loss, then you are receiving degraded auditory information. While wearing properly fit and programmed hearing aids can significantly improve the quality of auditory information that you receive, you can never restore it completely. 
Working memory compensates for this by using context clues and past experiences to piece together what's being said, which means that if hearing aids or cochlear implants are not able to restore the full audibility of sound, good working memory can fill in the missing gaps of what you're not hearing. And the fifth reason why working memory is so critical when it comes to hearing your absolute best is it helps your brain make sense of auditory information when you start treating your hearing loss with hearing aids, cochlear implants, or auditory brainstem implants. If you're a hearing aid user or cochlear implant user, then you already know it takes a little bit of time to adapt to a new hearing treatment. If you have good working memory, this adaptation time can be extremely short, but if you have bad working memory, you may never actually be able to get completely used to a new pair of hearing aids or a cochlear implant. Since cognition and working memory tend to decline as we get older, it is that much more important to make sure that you're doing everything in your power to improve your working memory if you want to be hearing your best. And this is exactly what the new Lace AI Pro working memory module is intended to do. The working memory module gives you different listening situations where you're required to recall specific information that you've heard. For instance, you may be given a scenario where you're going into a bank to open a new bank account. You find yourself speaking to a bank associate named Debbie and she's telling you all the different types of documentation that you need to open that bank account. She then gives you instructions on the paperwork that you need to complete to open the bank account, how much money you need to deposit into that bank account, and when that bank account will become active. Then you need to be able to answer questions about all the information that was given to you during that interaction. Let me go ahead and play an example for you directly from the app. Here's the setup. Imagine you're observing a professional plumber repair a broken pipe. I'm Jessica, and I'll be repairing your bathroom sink today. This is 432 Pine Lane, correct? I'll need my adjustable wrench from the tool rack in the van. It's essential for this task. Can you remember the address she mentioned? Can you remember the name of the plumber? Can you remember where she said the adjustable wrench was located? Each of these training sessions will have 10 different exercises that you need to complete, and it takes around 10 to 15 minutes to complete an entire training session. And they should be completed daily if you want to receive maximum improvement in your working memory. I can already tell after a few sessions doing it myself that I'm already getting better at working memory. What this means is that in just 10 minutes a day, you can significantly improve your hearing ability, whether it's in quiet situations or noisy situations. In fact, LACE has been proven by research to result in up to a six decibel signal to noise ratio improvement, which is massive, considering that that is roughly equivalent to a 60% speech understanding improvement in background noise. And this benefit can be added to the benefit that you're already receiving from hearing aids or a cochlear implant, meaning that it'll actually make your technology work even better. The app even lets you track your working memory training progress, showing how much your accuracy is improved over time and how much faster your response time is due to improvements in your processing speed. And you can see where you're at within each of the training modules as you work your way up to an expert communicator. Lace AI Pro is by far the lowest cost way to significantly improve your ability to hear, and it isn't even close. If you have hearing loss, whether you're using using hearing aids or not, you should 100% be using Lace AI Pro because it's considered audiologic best practice. Just imagine how awesome this app is going to be when they release all four of the training modules. And don't worry, because when you purchase a lifetime license of Lace AI Pro, you get every new module that they release in the future, even if they make more modules than the initial four. Okay, at this point, hopefully you know just how critical working memory is to your hearing and how to improve it. Meaning that if you want to hear your absolute best, no matter what situation you're in, auditory training using Lace AI Pro is a no-brainer.